And we're live, I think. Let me just check the actual thing. Uh, yep, we're live. Yes, we are live. I just realized I forgot to do... I turn the timers off for this. Yes, it did. Okay, cool. Cool. All right, so that's all good. Okay, now time to do the... The best part. The social media part. So, how was your day? Yeah, it was a Monday. Yeah, you know what? I know people say they don't like that we lost an hour, but it, today went by way faster than any Monday has for the last, like, six months. I have not noticed a difference. I immediately did. Every week has been long for the last few months for me. <clears throat> now it's starting to speed up. Good. Get to the stuff I want to see. Let's uh let's get to uh get to May. That's what I'm that's what I'm waiting for. By May. Uh Anime North. Mm. Yeah. I, I'm I'm ready for it. <laughs> oh, I'm ready for it. Come on, bring it. <laughs> All songs. Makes them a plane by Cobra Starship. Okay, let's see. I need to grab these. Nice. Uh, yep, and then grab these. All right, now to do the other social medias. Also, hi, Amaro, how you doing? Or blue. Howdy. You're, you're watching me. Hello. Hello. Uh, hello. Claire's server. Hi, Claire. Hello, Claire. Sorry, you guys are might get an ad here in a sec. Or might already have it one. It just ran an ad, I'm pretty sure. So it should be fine. <laughs> yeah, they're doing their Monday meetup a little early. Tonight, I don't know why, but I'm assuming there's a good reason. Claire wouldn't do that without a reason. Unless I'm being trolled. Both are very possible. I don't think I don't think I'm being trolled though. Okay. So got that. Got that. Claire, how was your day? That goes for everybody else in the chat. I hope you guys had a good day. Oh, um, there's a couple of things I wanted to ask you, hon. Um, yes. So when Mittens found out that I was doing Fable tonight, Mittens mm -hmm. immediately was just like, okay, you have to buy all the gems and then sell them back. I'm like, why? Because he's like, because you'll double your profit. I'm like, oh. Ah, I see Mittens as a person of culture. Yeah, Mittens knows this game. The economy is very scammable. Cause it... <laughs> that's, that's what I've heard. What were you going to say, sorry? Mm, I wasn't. You said, because it, and then you stopped. Oh, I. the reason I stopped is because I lost my train of thought. Oh. Oh my goodness.
You know what? I do that all the time. You do, yes. You have no room to judge. <laughs> I wasn't trying to judge you. I was just saying I do do that. <laughs> I'm not saying you were. I'm just saying you don't have room to judge if you were. Okay. I got to turn you down a little bit. You're really loud for me all of a sudden. Let me fix I that. was sleepy last time we were in a call, so that's why. That's Yeah, that would do it. Okay. But yeah, basically the uh, economy for the game kind of simulates or not simulates simulates how actual economy works where if it's if you're buying something and it's low in stock obviously the price for that item is going to go up and vice versa the price to buy it goes down so generally you'd wait for a fresh reset for the shops you'd buy out all of something and then you'd basically just do that a bunch of times and then sell it when it's all out of stock so you get like an extra 20 percent on return because Obviously, there is low supply, so there's high demand. Um, Mittens also told me about how you can um, you can game the real estate market by changing the <laughs> the date on your Xbox. <laughs> did you tell but Mittens I'm... which Fable game we're playing? Ah, uh, yes, I did. I mean, it's technically not wrong, but that's more so a mechanic for Fable two and three than yeah. for Fable one. Yeah. And of course, Mittens uh, decided to tell me, oh, I, if I had known you were playing Fable, you could have had m- my extra copy. I have two copies. I'm like, well, thanks for telling me. <laughs> I only mentioned it a couple of times. I just like, it's fine. It's fine. I was just grinding his gears. Mm. <clears throat> But yeah, at, considering how many times I've beaten the game, I basically just, at this point, start the game, get through all the tutorial business, and then spend like an hour just getting a bunch of gold so I can just buy a bunch of good equipment. Oh, the all the other thing he Mittens told me is that yes. um, to not pull the sword, uh, to only pull the, to, to not do too much grinding, because when I pull the sword, I get double stats or something. And that if I if I do grinding in between that, I won't be able to pull the sword next time because all my stats will be too high. Pull the sword. I don't know what that means. He just said that that don't pull the sword until. I know what sword like, he's don't... talking about. I'm confused about what. The... Okay, first of all, what are the pronouns so I don't keep dang them? Uh, he they. Okay. Okay, then that's fine. In that case, uh, I've never heard of any issues with that with the uh, that sword. Well, he just said specifically with Legend or Anniversary. Well, he's play he's talking original, so I don't know if that maybe has been fixed. But he just said that like you'll um you don't like if you if you if you pull the sword, do uh do some leveling and then your stats are too high, you won't get to the next sword pull because you'll be too strong, is what he said. I know the requirements to do this sword pull is really high naturally. That's weird. I mean, I don't think that's something you're going to have to worry about regardless. Yeah. Nikki, hi. Hi. First time chatter. You've never chatted in my chat? Wow. <clears throat> it's I a mean, fun in fairness, okay. Nikki, I own three copies of Fable 3, so. Are you a fan? No, I just played it for five hours and bought it again. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Um, Why do I own two copies of... Uh... <clears throat> Of Shinobi three and two copies of <laughs> two copies of uh, oh what is it that I own two copies of oh um and two copies of Revenge of Shinobi I thought I didn't have it <laughs> I also I kept... technically own two copies of Fable Anniversary one for Xbox and one for PC that's fair. Every time I search Fable, Fable SMP comes up. What is that? I have no idea. Oh, Oh, that's that's Minecraft related. Oh, okay. There's a Fable Minecraft. No. You own four copies of Borderlands 2? Oh, it's part of Minecraft. Okay, sorry. It's a Minecraft Let's Play series thing. Okay, Nikki, that one I understand, because if you own four copies, you keep one for yourself and give your friends the other copy so you can play multiplayer with them. 
That one makes sense. I mean, I also own a couple copies of random Pokemon games, so yeah, that's fair. Like, uh, uh, I somehow ended up with two copies of Diamond. I had two Leaf Green, two Emerald. Um, there's probably one other I'm forgetting. This. Oh. Okay. I'm just about done. Last thing, last place I'm posting. I swear. All right. There we go. All the socials are done. So now I can start the game. Four copies all in different systems? Yeah, that makes sense. That sounds like something you do. <laughs> I'll do it. Oh, my goodness. All right, here we go. Xbox 360, but I'm playing on the Xbox One. A little confused. <laughs> Just a little bit. Just so everybody knows, this is not skippable. It is not, no. Oh, hey, I'm signed into Xbox Live! Yes. <laughs> I made sure ahead of time that I signed in and everything, because I know that's a pain in the ass with these, because mm. the 360 what doesn't hasn't been updated to include... Uh, um, oh, look, that thing that no longer exists. Yeah, smart class. I saw this, and I'm like... I don't think this still works. And also, it shows Windows Phone and Windows Tablet. I don't think this Fun is going to work. Fun fact, it is technically impossible to get all achievements in Fable Anniversary because this was discontinued. Mm -hmm. Ah, oh, there's that music. I can barely hear the music. You can hear it? Yeah. Oh, I hear it now. Okay, yeah, but... That's why um, I've been turned up on Discord, but yeah. Yeah, the... um. The 360, because it was pre uh, T2A with um, with Microsoft accounts, um, you have to generate a password for every time you sign into a 360. So I had to make really? a new password for this game, and then I had to do another one for Silent Hill. <laughs> <clears throat> so I'm signed into a different instance on each 360 game I own. You're here because WoW RP Machinima we call fables an experience. WoW Machinima, what? I okay, so just full disclosure, I have never played a fable game outside maybe a couple hours of the first one. A friend had it, uh, then eventually my brother got it, and I I just never played it. And then I was like, it's one of my favorite games, and I was like, well, I have to play it now. I would say it's. Probably, if not top five, top ten games of all time for me. Yeah. Like, you've seen some of my favorite games. It's only fair mm -hmm. that I play some of yours. And then, also, I did Majora's Mask when Sky was around. So, mm -hmm. only fair. It's your turn. <laughs> yeah. I've probably beaten this game at least 30 times. I, yeah, I think I remember you saying that. Yeah. <laughs> Fable one is very good. See, I was deciding between uh, this, um, the Lost Chapters version, or the original, and I decided to go with this because of the enhancements. Um, I know that may not be purest for some people, but I want to have <laughs> the easiest time and not deal with any jank. And if this version fixes some of that, then I'll take that. Um, I mean, I've already explained that mine is purely nostalgia. Mm-hmm. Have you played through this version of the game? Twice. Oh, so you have played through Anniversary. Okay. Yeah. I bought it. I pre-ordered it. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't be surprised. Did you get a collector's edition of it or something? I don't know if there was one. Did you play it on 360? Yeah. Okay. I got I got that. I got the uh, guidebook that came that they also released with it. Do you still have the guidebook? Give me one second to check. You might have to, you might have to uh, check it. Well, if you've beaten this game so many times, you might not have to, but it doesn't hurt to have uh, reference yes, material do. on hand. There you go. Ugh. 
<laughs> is it that big? <laughs> no, I just had to reach up because it's in my closet. Ah, I see. All right. Well, we have stalled long enough. Let's start the game and choose to save. I will say it's storage. a very beautiful guidebook, by the way. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. You'll have to send me pictures uh, later. Yeah. It's got that nice, that cool thing where they have it all painted gold along the outer out, the outer edges of the pages. Oh, yeah. What did the, one of my Monster Hunter art books did that? I think the one that I got with uh, World. It's really nice. Trauma will guide you through if Shrek was a Hobbit Simulator 2008. <laughs> How many nicknames yeah, do you have? I'd say that's fairly accurate. Yeah. I'd say it's right. fairly accurate, yeah. New game. So do I get to create a character? No. No? Nope. Slow down for haircuts, beards, must mustaches. Okay. You can cut. You can technically customize, but you cannot create. Things like uh, hair, beards, mustaches, tattoos, and obviously armor. Oh, there it is. Deep in the forest of Albion, lay the small town of Oakvale. Ah, uh, classic voice. I've changed my time. And, untouched and this version has a higher quality audio, I believe. Mm. This is another reason why I picked it. And his family, a boy dreaming of greatness, but one day being a hero. Mm. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. <laughs> But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Ah, oh, this game's music is beautiful. Are you nostalgia bombing right now? Come on, oh, 100%. Up. Daydreaming again, were you? Just like your mother. Mind always wandering. Well, let it wander off to find your sister, will you? <laughs> oh, man. She's out playing by the Barrowfield Gate. Remember, you haven't given her a birthday present yet. Oh, yeah, I remember this part. Got to get one. Well, I'm not bailing you out this time, son. Hmm. I tell you what, I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Now, get moving and stay out of trouble. It's funny because I just finished the appendices of The Hobbit. So I'm already in, um, I'm already in like medieval, middle earthy type of world mode mm -hmm. you have a dozen names for fable i'm sure i'm gonna hear all of them throughout this playthrough anytime you're around <laughs> are the people marking your map with the green dot okay okay so i gotta talk to the people oh thank god the map's in a good spot my phone is technically blocking what's in the bottom right there and then you are on my screen so i can't see what that is but uh bottom right is expressions okay not necessary for gameplay not really, no. What's this pulsating? Oh, it's dead. That's your main quest objective. Do I gotta talk to the people first? Uh, just people outlined in green. Just the green people, got it. Just yep. the Shreks. Uh, can I open this door? I could punch it. Oh, wait. A green person. There goes Brom's kid. What's uh, action, eh? Hey. I've lost Rosie. I, I left her and I can't remember where. What's a Rosie? Her stuffing needs changing today. That's fair. And I can't find her. Please help. She's a lovely little furry bear with a blue patch on her back. Hi, Cherry. I'm good. I'm just starting Fable. Okay, so I gotta find a blue, uh, a bear with a blue patch on its back. Okay. I assure you, it's not gonna be hard to find. Also, you can press B to run if memory serves. You are correct. Okay, these people. 
or green. Hurry, that is the merchant you will buy the gift from. Okay. So talking to him doesn't mean anything. I'm a trader. Pretty much. I wander the world buying and selling wares, especially to find This looks really good, by the way. Mm hmm Some little girl I saw said you have a sister, and it's her birthday. And it seems you haven't got her a present yet. Who snatched it? A present. It just so happens that I have a rather nice box of sweets here. Guaranteed to put a smile on any sister's face for only three gold pieces. Maybe later, but hurry before I eat them myself. Remember, three gold coins, that's all they cost. We gold coins? We gold Arrange coins. We gold bread, coins. Uh, is this a different kid? No. No, that is her. Oh, let's see. Okay. If memory serves, if you click in with the right stick, you can also make the map bigger. Oh, there and then we go. you click it again, it'll go away. Then click it again, and it'll go back to normal size. Oh, there we go. Yep. Honestly, where's that? Where's that filthy layabout husband of mine? <laughs> With some woman, I don't doubt. I run his house, bring up his children, and what do I get in return? Yeah, that sounds Nothing. about right, Nikita. Look for the time. It was supposed to be compete with Elder Scrolls, but Fable 3's DLC approach kind of kneecapped it. Ah, okay. If you find him, let me know, won't you? You'll respect the rules if you know what's good for you. Okay. I still haven't found this bear. Oh, you can hold A and run too. Okay. Oh, it's A. Okay. Couldn't tell which one that. Okay, no. I'm refamiliarizing myself with the button layout without it in front of me. Mm -hmm. That's fair. Get him off me! Please help! Oh, do I have to beat somebody up? You have the option too. You'll only be able to hit characters when they have a red highlight. If you attack a non-hostile character, you must lock onto them by pulling... Okay, left trigger and pressing X. Okay. Get up, you bitch. I won't lie, generally when I do this, I'll also just turn around and punch that kid for the afterwards. Why is that? Just for fun? Rosie! Oh! Teddy bear! I gotta return the bear, right? Oh, there she is. Your stuffing. There we go. So I gotta perform at least one more good deed to get enough, uh, enough gold. What's this man want? Wait. Is that the world woman's husband? Oh, thank goodness. No. Listen, lad, could you do me a favor? Promise table's gonna look like lo fi girl. What do you mean by that? I've got to, you know, answer a call of nature. Oh, stay here and watch this stock for me. There's a good lad. I am curious what you mean by Just that, actually. Stand between those two stacks I've seen a lot of different table. tables for lo fi girls, so I'm not sure which one you're referencing. Don't put a good word make me try to get out of that. <laughs> I assume she means discovered in a right, bunch of paper and books and stuff. 
I mean, it would would Kurama have quite a study? If I had room for a study, probably yes. Just a, just a bunch of books uh, like it's crunch night. Oh, okay. What if I smash you? You can do that. You want to steal? Are you just gonna stand there like a lemon? You just gonna stand there like a lemon? Also, stand close to the boxes by the time the time goes down. So, yeah, because if I smash these boxes, these ones, center boxes, center boxes, these ones. Yeah, see how the timer goes green. I didn't see that. A little more to the left. There we go. There we go. Because otherwise, it'll count it as you abandoning it. Oh, okay. Gotta be specific boxes. Pretty much. Basically where he left you. So I just... I just keep beating on the kid until the guy comes running back. <laughs> Excellent. Thanks, lad. You've done me a big favor. But wouldn't I get more bad favors or whatever? Or bad deeds? If I kept hitting him? Really, no. Oh, okay. I mean, yeah, I probably would, Nikki. Nikki I'd probably have a section just for the fable books. I gotta find that lady's husband. You also disappeared your map. What? I said you disappeared your map. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. Where is that good for nothing husband? Look, that right got you, you little ruffian. What the hell? You beat up a kid. I've heard reports that you've been doing bad deeds. Violent conduct towards a person or persons without God's permission. That sort of behavior is not acceptable. If you were older, you'd be apprehended and fined by the town guards. You need to oh, the concept art for this game is great. That is worth it, my young Are you looking through the book right now? Yeah. I'll leave it at that for now. But think about what I've said. Okay. Where's the good for nothing husband? Which one is which one is a drunk? Different about that boy. Is it one of the green dots or am I Yes. It is? Okay. Yep. You've already gone past it, by the way. Oh I did? Okay. Yep. Go head towards your house. Head towards my house, okay. Many lovely things. No, he's the He's the yeah. Take a left up there. Take a left. It's not this guy, is it? Yep. No, he's behind the house. He's behind the house. Oh, okay. Is that him then? Yep. What? Uh, I, I was just um. I, I've never even met this woman. Who is she? <laughs> Smooth. In fairness, he's talking to like a seven-year-old. So. Right. Oh yeah, no. I've the book has some stuff about what they aspired to do in for the game, and yeah, no, there were some really great things I wish they'd been able to realize or actualize. Uh, no, not when you're supposed to be working and you know providing for your family. Tell you what, if you keep this little secret, I'll give you a gold piece. Can I? What I do is I get. Yep, and then you can go straight to his wife. And get a good deed out of it. Nice. Good lad. Here, have this gold piece. My advice to you, don't get tied down to one woman. Listen, if if <laughs> that's something you gotta agree with beforehand. I mean, I agree, but not but not the way you're doing it. The way I'm doing it, yes. Look after yourself. The way you're doing it, no. Everyone else. You mean a scumbag. Don't be a cheater. You want to be Polly? Be Polly. Uh, okay, where is she? She's up. She's down here. I go down. She? Yeah. Yep. 
That reminds me, I want to read, uh, I want to read that, uh, that manga. Really? The, that, that new one that's coming out about polyamory, or no, it's a, not a, not a manga, it's a, what do you call it, uh, uh, Wait, not a, some, a something tune. What are they called? Webtoon. Webtoon. Yeah, no kidding, Nikki. It's really bold considering there's like 30 people in this village. I mean, I didn't do anything. He asked me not to tell his wife. I took the money. I'm going to tell his wife anyway. Now go and keep yourself out of trouble. But I realize this is the game teaching you not to do bad deeds unless you want bad things to happen to you. Pretty much, yeah. Where's that filthy layabout husband of mine? <laughs> With some woman, I don't doubt. I run his house, bring up his children. If you find him, let me know, won't you? You have? Right. I'm gonna turn him into Balverine food. Uh-oh. Man here cheating in his wife and the woman in the same hamlet, Thank bold. You, yeah. Young sir, for telling me. You can also follow her after her as she runs to berate her husband. Oh, really? Yep. Oh, shit. Hands on that guy. <laughs> oh, no, you have it memorized. I have a lot of the game's voice lines memorized, yeah. about you well if you think i'm going to cook and clean for you while you're out having a good time with your stupid you've got another thing coming you know i only have eyes for you my sweet who is she anyway some tart from the village <laughs> listening to the me, british people banter is kind of cute okay now it's looping yeah All right, so I need to go back to dead. Mm. I'm a man of my word, so here's the gold for your good deeds. But if you think that I'll turn a blind eye to your mischief, you're very wrong. Also, you can go inside your house, and there's a couple of things you can interact with too. To keep out of trouble, please, for me. Okay, dead. Well, I think you may have enough there, son. Have you spoken to the trader? Good old Brahm. Okay, so I'm gonna go in the house because there's stuff you said I could interact with. Yep. The bookshelves. Oh, bookshelves? Yep, there's three of them, I think. I don't remember which one has what, though. You already interact with that one? Oh, okay. Okay, that's not a bookshelf. Yep, that one over there. There we go. It's you and your sister's bed. You find your sister's diary. Okay. Tell us where I think father is as soon as she goes. Harvest. Day 18. Okay, so it, it, it labels it by harvest and I guess other parts of the year instead of months. Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> Wait, what'd that she say? She, she's going out to sea? Yep, she's out in the field. And yeah, now I'm going to play on top of the field. Okay. Okay, so I gotta go get the present. Yep. There's no time like the present. Also, if you target a chicken and press uh, X, you can kick it. Why would I want to do that? Chicken kicking. I've played Zelda. It's actually a game mode in the later part of the game. I've still got these sweets. Quickly, give me three gold pieces now, and they're yours. Young sir, they are yours. Wish your sister a happy birthday for me now. <laughs> yeah, pretty much, Nikki. It's a very eventful, eventful day. 
Dead, you wasn't even there. I had to fight some pro or watch boxes and gain a basic understanding of adultery all within 50 feet of our house. Mischief just follows me. <laughs> oh, that's great. Mm -hmm. Not wrong. Chocolate. Not wrong at all. All right. So now I've got to go upwards. Hey, don't call me strange lady. Is that right, there? Yep. Also, can you check this character? Oh, never mind. I, oh, no, I think it's after this talk. Don't worry about it. Like you did last year. I'm sorry if I woke you up last night. It was another. Oh, it's an older sister. Okay. I was standing yes. In field, Big sis. Happened, but I can't remember what. Never I guess I was like in, uh, in my head. I thought it would be cousin. a younger sister. Mm -mm. I knew you were going to bring me chocolates. It's just like my dream. Come on, let's go. That's home. what we love about Nikki. <laughs> yeah. Unhinged fantasy. Okay, so I gotta talk to the scarecrow. Uh, I just can't remember if it gives something. Because I know you can't access it after the childhood portion. So, uh, try re-interacting. Yeah, okay. Nothing interesting. Okay, it's fine then. Okay. So I know you can't get to this area once this next bit happens. So I couldn't remember if there was something hidden there. Can't go over that. Nope. No jumping or anything. I was gonna say, I assume there's no jumping in this game. But but I'm sure you would have told me otherwise. Yep. Wait. There's something wrong. And now the fun begins. Oh fuck. They're here. You've got to hide. I not see that kid. Evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. Why would bandits want to burn stuff, though? Don't they want to steal? Blood red flames lit the night. I mean, they can do both. Screamed and People can't resist you stealing if they're dead. And soon, their That's bodies fair. filled the streets. Then the raiders reached the last house, where the boy and his family lived. It was then they had slaughtered so many to find. The father fought to protect his kin, but he was no warrior, and fell mortally wounded. Damn! In a cutscene, no less. Apart, but he yep. could not find the boy. Oh god, is that the mother? Through torture and threats, no. his mother and sister remained silent, and their furious attackers took them both. From the nearby woods, the boy watched as all he knew was taken away. His whole life was crushed pretty much, to yeah. He was alone. I fucking love these wall arts they do. Well, at this very moment, Britannia burns. What? Sorry, I was quoting the Guardian from uh, Ultima 8. Hmm. Sorry, one sec here. <sighs> Okay, here we go. It's just a bunch of fire. Yep. Fires and bodies. Well, can't go that way. 
Hmm? Yeah, you can. Oh, I can? But there's fire. Yeah. Take a right. Oh, I can go through here. Oh, I thought this was a house. It was a bridge. Oh, look, there's dear old dad. Remember, it's not a fancy RPG if your child character still has both parents. <laughs> Jesus. And it was without trauma. We must leave. It's not safe here. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Then give me your hand. Well, that line messed up. Hmm? Unless my headset cut out. I didn't notice anything. So. Oh, excuse me. Hey! I got an achievement from the small state corn. Avatar Award unlocked! Oh boy! <laughs> Mm hmm. Hmm. I thought you'd have a stronger stomach than that. Come on. Save your energy, boy. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Come with me. Every time I see Oakville, I, in my head, I'm re I'm correcting it to Oakville. Because that's the place in Ontario. My name is Mays, and I'm the head of the Guild of Heroes. You must have heard of it. You'll find nowhere safer in all of Albion, nor a better place to call your home. And if it's vengeance you want, you'll need the training only we can offer. Ah, oh, the music. Ah, yes. Here we are. Get them started on vengeance I'll early. You to the guild master. Yeah, he'll be got to start young from now on. I really like the uh, loading screen too. Yeah, and it does get filled out more as you discover more areas. I figured as much. Mm -hmm. Though this is new to anniversary, it wasn't a thing in the original. Oh, okay. I have a new student for you. Put him in the dorm upstairs with the girl. You don't look much like hero material to me, but Maze knows what he's doing, I suppose. Well, I got a Fable Brand t shirt for my not me. Yes. <laughs> for my <laughs> Xbox character who's wearing an Earthworm Gym shirt. Because it's me. <laughs> You'll be sharing this room with Whisper, one of our brightest young pupils. She's playing oh, Whisper. In the right now, but you'll meet her. You know, I just realized. For now, hmm. you should get some I'm playing Your a, stuff an Xbox 360 remake of an Xbox game on an Xbox One with an Xbox Series controller. There's like four <laughs> layers of Kevin Bacon here. Yeah. It's time to wake up. You must be my roommate. Hmm. Shorter than I expected. My name's Whisper. I've been here for a month. Had the room to myself till now, too. But that's all right. You know you talk in your sleep. Sounded like a bad nightmare. Happens to a lot the first week. Some don't even last that long. You won't either if you don't get moving. The Guildmaster is waiting for us in the map room. You don't want to be late on your first day. Follow the map me. room? Yes. Where you talk to the guildmaster. You know, the one with the giant map in the center. Yeah. Hmm. Looks like the guildmaster got tired of waiting for you. He's probably at the training grounds across the river. Let's go. Okay. Before I do that, I need <laughs> to use the bathroom. I'll be right back. Okay. You're in charge of chat, hon. Okay. So how are we enjoying ourselves so far?
We do love a good vibe. I'm back. Welcome back. Vibin'. Well, that's good. <laughs> this tea is brought to you by Russell Shaw with the Read of Fall with Danny Elfman. Danny Elfman has made the same soundtrack for movies multiple times. Probably didn't need to do that, but yeah, that never hurts. Okay. So we gotta go this way it seems. The hell? Oh someone to interact with. It's the innkeeper. Use the expressions. Okay. <clears throat> Who's I, this dining room I can't see the them. Meals are served. The don't worry about them. They don't have too much use of our own. Okay. Okay. Oh, we got a ring. Oh! What up? Thanks for the raid. Welcome, Raiders. Hello. Hello. Ah, oh, thank you, hon. We're playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel. Ooh. Oh, thanks for stopping by. Hello. My name is Zero. I'm your cat boy, sometimes cat girl, VTuber. And I am joined by the wonderful Kurama. Hi. But don't make her mad or she'll bonk you. <laughs> I do like bonking. There's a whole emote for that. <laughs> yes. All right. So there's some people over here I want to talk to. We're by the way, we're playing Fable Anniversary. This is my first time playing through it. Um, upstairs. Best stay away though. He's a scary man. All right. Well, I'll do what you say. Is that a friggin' what? I got an oh, apple. Apple. Yes. You've finally prized yourself. All right, lad. It's time to see if you've any potential. Get in the ring. All right. Now then, I want you to hit that dummy <laughs> as hard oh, as hutch, you Nikki. can. Oh, hutch, Nikki. Pretty cool, I guess. Everyone going till I tell you to <laughs> here is. Hey. I like had... to think I'm pretty cool. I've only had nice things to say about you, Nikki. Okay, wants me to target. Okay. You're not making much of an impact there, are you? Here, try with this. Oh, I got a stick. What? Not a sword. You're like five. Daggers will work for a kid. The game doesn't have daggers. Really? No, it does not. Ah. It's got long swords, katanas, uh, axes, great swords, 
uh, maces, war picks, bows, crossbows, and warhammers. Well then. Now pick it up. I don't think I'm forgetting anything. There's a play Frog in it demo? Exploration item finding game. Oh, interesting. Frog on it. Frog gone. Well it. Done, okay. Dad. Now then, tomorrow we'll. I'm going to stroke my own ego, but like to jokingly pull yours. <laughs> sure, sure. To test your spirit. I'll wait for you at the guild I mean, you can always do both, Nikki. While you deal you're great at multitasking. Once you're done, we can of course you wouldn't encourage somebody training. bullying me. Why wouldn't you? Yes. I mean, it helps that it's Nikki, so. Yeah. Considering so. I've known her longer than I've known you. Yeah. I see. Apple. Oh, no, what I meant to do. Apple. 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 <laughs> do that every time I get an apple. Apple. Into the woods. Yield woods. I gotta get ten bugs, eh? Ten beetles. All they did was give me a stick. You'll be fine. Will I? <gasps> Butterflies. Yes. Oh, they're all over there, I see. Yep. Enemies are marked as red. Sound more like cicadas to me. Oh, yeah, they're classified as beetles. Yep. I like that it auto targets the next enemy. Mm -hmm. And then you can flick left or right to uh, adjust who you're targeting. Okay, gotcha. There's one more left. One more behind you. All right. Yes, we do have Apple. Apple! Apple! <laughs> Even late in the game, there'll be apples to be like, oh man, I got this big boss fight. Hey, an apple! <laughs> <laughs> All right, guess I gotta go back and report my deed. Mm -hmm. I defeated the cicada beetles. Yes. Sub Beatles. I'm like weirdly chilly on my shoulders and the top of my back, but nowhere else. Good work, lad. Those beetles can be a damn. It's a weird place for me to be chilly. Yeah. I think you've earned yourself some pocket money for that. If you want more gold, I'm sure the servants could use your help with something. Nicky, don't do that. Don't explode. Or you can get an early night. Do you wish to leave your childhood behind and begin apprentice training? Yes. The guild was now the boy's life. The memory of the Oakvale flames still scorched his mind. But soon he had no thought other than training, and he became stronger and more agile with every passing year. His days were filled with grueling exercises, the nights with study in the library. Hmm. Finally, he was ready to become a guild apprentice, just as Maze had foreseen. The real training was about to begin. Old sleeve will probably be warmer. Jedi, what sleeve? To meet the guild master on the other side of the river. But that was an hour ago. We better get going. Race you there. Okay, before I do that, I need to... Sure. The other shirt was too heavy. But this one will be a little lighter. <laughs> Sweater. There, I'm just putting my sweater on. That's the 
other arm. Okay. Here we go. Boy fit. All right. There. Now I'm comfy. Okay. To run. Press and hold. Okay. Well, I knew that. You're going to race me, I thought? Yep. As soon as you leave the room. Race. <laughs> this way? Oh. Yep. There you go. Ah, crap. Ah! I will drink water here in just a second. I'm losing this race. Yes, yes, you are. Get out of my way! You're in my way, sir. Get out of my way, sir. And she got stuck by the other people, right? Right? Guildmaster. Late again. You can put that old stick away. We'll begin training with real weapons now. Get used to the weight right. of this sword. I will drink the water. Let's see if you can hit Whisper with it. Hey, a sword. Ah, oh, a long sword. But you're a wizard hero. God damn it. Really? Yes. This game is going to be full of references, isn't it? Yes. Come on, then. Let's see what you've got, farm boy. You just need to hit her. There's no actual combat yet. How did that get? Now pay attention. What I'm about to teach you could well save your life one day. All right. The life of a hero is block. a dangerous one, and you must learn to block your enemy's attacks if you expect to live long. Whisper will try to hit you, but you can block her attacks with your sword. Not all blows can be blocked, but you should be able to handle anything Whisper can throw at you. Okay. you next time also fun fact if you're as long as you're holding block you'll block behind you as well oh really attacks from behind yep well done now let's see if thunder attack and defense ah oh, hello thunder come to check on your up a man programs, have you you could say that. Whisper told me you got a training with some fan boy. Maze thinks the boy has great potential. Enough to keep up with my Whisper. Ha. <laughs> well, why don't we see? Whisper and the boy are just working on their melee skills now. All right, children. Let's see who has learned the most in their training. This will be a no That is her big brother, by the way. Just oh, like I couldn't tell by the fact that he said it was his yourself. little sister. <laughs> Don't forget to lock on. That's all wrong, Whisper. You need to practice more. Shame you couldn't see me fight in the arena. You might have learned a thing or two. Keep training if you want to go there yourself one day. You told me that. I beaten him if you hadn't stopped us. Yes, yes, yes. We have few enough heroes as it is, without the two of you tearing each other apart in training. Speaking of which, meet me as I make my way to the archery range, when you're ready to continue your lessons. Oh, and about your melee performance. Excellent. Fight like that in your melee exam, and you'll do well. There's exams now? What is this, school? Yes. Quite literally. Then meet me by the archery range to continue your training. Also, if you do well in the exams, you get basically upgraded weapons and such. Oh, okay. Yeah. Basically, just get all this basic training now, and then they appear. Archery training. Let's continue our training with the bow. 
Oh, you a longbow. longbow. To begin with, see if you can hit the three stationary targets. And put some effort into it. The longer you pull back your bowstring, the more damage you will cause. But make sure you stay within the circle. Okay. <laughs> okay. First, you'll need to unsheathe your bow. This cord is being annoying. Is it? Yeah. Oh my controller's vibrating. Yep. Well done. You hit all the targets. Unfortunately, most foes don't stand still. So let's see how you fare against moving targets. You have a minute to score as many points as you can. The front target is worth one point, the middle one is worth three, and the one at the back will score you nine points. And remember, the longer you pull back your bowstring, the more damage the shot will cause. More damage means more points, but you have to balance power, firing rate, and accuracy. Let's see what you can do. All right. Funny enough, the one in the back is, in my opinion, the easiest one to hit. Oh, really? Yeah. So that's more so due to familiarity with patterns and such. Plenty of power. Lovely. Our target. Oh, right. You said with the stick. So let me choose the targets, though. Because uh, I think it's just because it's cl closest in proximity. I think the others are too far away for you to actually lock onto. Well, uh, no, not technically, but I think the one moving it in the front is making it hard to actually target the ones in the back. Keep them coming. I just got to click on the stick to. Do it first. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Then boy. you can do it again to get a second zoom. Excellent hit. Keep them coming. There you go. Damn it. If you want to know the pattern for the one at the back, it's basically hold right there, and as soon as it's bouncing back, you let go. Or as soon as it like hits the wall. Oh. I'm sure you'll improve when you take your skill test. Should I redo that? No, that's fine. Next, okay. we will learn about the ways of. It'll only matter when you actually, if you actually do the exam for it. Ready to continue with your training. I'll be heading to the island by the waterfall. Okay. Any princes want to practice melee combat? Oh, there you go. You can do the melee exam right now if you want. Oh, I can. Talk to the guy in black. Right. This melee combat against Whisper counts. Basically, you want to do it without getting hit. Right. Let's get Whisper and you in the ring. Can I Same block? As before. Yeah. I have a special without price taking damage. If you manage an A plus. Okay. Lock on. Damn it, I got hit. Oh. How did that get yeah, I got hit twice. Can I redo it? Yeah. You can do it as many times as you want. Stop now. Almost perfect. That's an A. I've got a nice sword for you, if you can get an A+. Right, this melee combat... Right, let's get whispering. I have a special. Pr How did that hit? Huh? All right. There you go. Hey, did it? Oh, okay, God. quite as whisper. Whisper should be ashamed. A plus. 
<laughs> They're really throwing that shade on Whisper. I can award you a new yeah. Iron Katana. Slightly better. You really showed Whisper. Okay, so... Can I do the archery one now, too, or...? Uh, go check out the guys there. Now the guildmasters asked yep. me to grade everyone's archery ah. skills. And if you get an A+, you'll receive a special prize. You've got one minute, starting when you fire your first shot. Okay. This, I don't remember what the requirement is for the actual point score. You know what? Let me see if I can find it. Was superb. That was superb. That was superb. Yeah, the book doesn't say the actual score you need to hit for it. Yeah. Probably a hundred, I assume. Probably. You set a new high score. Oh, no, you might have gone A+. Well, not bad. Oh, no, C. No. you, uh, let me see. A C. Remember, you can still come back and try and get that A+. Plus. Now, the Guildmaster's asked me to grade... I'm gonna try a plus, shooting the guy in the back. You've got one minute. Yeah. St Okay, and once he bounces the wall. Oh, shit, I screwed up. Well, that didn't hit him. Nope. Hit the guy in front of him. Ugh. That didn't work. Right as he's approaching the wall, though. There we go. There we go. Got him. Fuck. The guy in the back has a lot of points, though. Mm -hmm. Damn it. No. Oh. No, that didn't work either. Basically, as he passes the reticle. Going right, I mean. There we okay. go. Almost hit him that time. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Well, not great, is it? Just a D for you there. Remember, you can. Not the kind of D I like. Ask me to grade it. <laughs> and if you get an A plus, you've got one minute. Memory serves the arrows are still there, so you can try aiming further to the right of it. Unless the now they fade by now. Oh no, there's there again. Damn it. Too late. Speaking. Damn it. Damn it. Too late. Oh, almost at it. No, damn it. I need to find the sweet spot. Mm -hmm. Try slightly to the left. Oh, oh there that was it. Oh. Excellent power. I hit him. You can try aiming a little lower so you're aiming for the uh, chest instead of the head as well. There we go. 
There, there we go. go. I want to say the highest I've gone is like 300 something points. Damn it. Oh, almost out. Wow. You, you set a new high score. Wow, that's excellent. Oh, I can give it's you a, a little bit more. Probably like 150. You can the guild master Probably. Master I think you got 132. Yeah. And if you get an, you've got one minute. Okay. So. Well, now you've got a good idea of what to go for. Damn it. Too early. Damn it. Too late. Damn it. Okay. There you go. Fuck. Shit. I mean, you can, you can always just try going for the middle guy since he's fairly reliable too. Oh. Wait, what? He accidentally clicked in the stick. Yeah, whatever. Time's up. Day for you there. Remember, you can still come back and try and get. Now the guild masters asked me to grade everyone's archery skills. I can't see what the next one. Oh, it's A. And if you get an A plus, you've got one minute. You try going for the middle guy. You're right. Yeah. Everyone waste too much more time. Yeah. Yes. something at least that was superb fuck that was superb Nothing there. Damn it. Excellent power. Ugh. Oh, there you go. One sixty nine. Nice. Wow. You, you set a new high score. Wow. I mean, there you go. Nice. Ha. Got it with one sixty nine. Sweet. The guild master said if anyone shot brilliant. I could award them this. Personally, I don't care for crossbows. I just find longbows more comfortable to use. Whew, that was some fancy shooting. Yeah, I gotta go down and, here. Whoops. Yeah, I like doing it just because it, the guildmaster takes a little bit to actually walk over there, so I'll just generally knock those out real quick while he's walking. Ah. Uh. There's just the will left to learn. It's time to learn about will powers. We'll begin by striking these strong dummies with lightning. Will is magic, by the way. That's what I figured. B e button. Okay. Okay. Right trigger. Uh, what's happening? What's going on here? Hold on. I'm hitting B and nothing's happening. Oh, it's your thing is being blocked. It's in the bottom right. Yeah, I see it. When I hit That's B, lightning nothing, power. Nothing's happening. Is it because my sword's uh, out? No. no, no, no. Who's lightning? Uh, trying to remember controls. Oh, there you go. Whatever you did there. See how many I, I didn't do anything except press B. 
Only attack dummies. You have to hold down something and then press B. Well, I think said right trigger LT. And B. Hold right trigger and B. Yeah, that's what it said. Using your willpowers depletes your mana, and once used, it takes time to replenish. Oh, it's LT. Ah, that would do it. Yeah. He just electrocuted the guildmaster. You're getting the hang of it. <laughs> I'm not trying to hit him, it just keeps aggroing him for some reason. Oh no, it happens all the time, it's just funny. Honestly, I feel like it was intentional in the game's part to do that. Very good, lad. You have learned the three hero disciplines. We can now move on to your final test if you're ready. Or you can spend some more time... Uh, decline this one. That way you can do the uh, will test, and then there's something you can do in the woods. Oh, okay. Yeah, whisper in the woods. Play. B. Very well. I'll be in the map room when you're ready to continue. Okay. <laughs> okay, so... Yeah, I'll take a second to walk here. If you actually look at your map, you see the green dot moving? Yeah. That's the will trainer. Mm. It's nice actually being able to... Once you recognize what's what, just actually watching it, things update. Yeah. <clears throat> <clears throat> Taking the time to get here. I mean, he's walking here, yeah. Now, this is it that being really funky? Is it that path up in the right I'm going to go to after this? Uh, up to the right, yeah. Okay. There he is. You can go up and talk to him if you want. Any apprentices need wheel training? You've got 30 seconds once you first cast lightning to hit as many targets as you can. There's a special prize for A-plus students, you know. I'm trying not to hit you. <laughs> oh, got in trouble. Look, boy. You can't just go around attacking people within the game. I wasn't trying to. You been listening to <laughs> yeah, I skip this. I don't care. Can I go and do the test again? Yeah. How the hell do I get out of here? The stairs. Oh, there's stairs. Uh, oh, I didn't realize there were stairs there. It's darker <laughs> for me than it is for you, by the way. That would make sense. Okay. Have you checked settings to see if you can increase brightness? Yeah, but then it's going to make the... It's too bright for the stream. Yeah. Where am I going? I'm going to go down here, right? Yep. Down that way. If you want to do it the easiest way to avoid overlapping like that, it's to basically... Stand on in front of the right bit of the bridge, facing so that the are the uh, dummies are facing long ways away from you. That way, you don't okay. keep circling around to attack him. So, nope, turn around. Right so, in front of that bit on the right. Right here. Yep, and then target the dummy to your directly closest to you, and then just use lightning that way. Then angle your camera back right. Then when it stop pulling it down. You're just burning mana. That's astonishing. Oh, I got a A plus. That's easy. Guildmaster said to award these yeah. items to anyone who excelled at the will test. No. 
That's basically a free potion to refill will. That's a resurrection name. It's in the name. You can have a maximum of nine, I believe. Mm. Nine lives. How perfect. To the right. Oh, right, to the right. Yeah. Ooh, that was some fancy shooting. Yeah, main quest, main story quest objectives are gold, side, oh, you just passed Whisper. Side quests are silver. I'll follow you into the woods. Hi, Paris. Hi, Paris. All right, beetle hunting. The beetle nest is just at the top of the... Wait. Did you hear that? It's coming from over there. Bandits. If only we could get across that stream. I know. Why don't you use your bow? Or some of that lightning the guildmaster taught you? I'll heal you if you get hurt. All right. Nice. Took his head off. Boom, headshot. To the left. You asshole. Here you go. We did it. Did you see the look on their faces? Wait till the guildmaster hears about this. Don't forget to hold down the button to draw the experience to you. Right. I'm holding it. Nothing's happening. Uh. Unless they did disappear. Unless it just gave it to you during the cutscene, that's possible. Well, what's that in the top right corner? Top right corner? Whip it. Top left corner, sorry. Oh, that's your combat multiplayer. Oh, uh, okay. Basically, earn more XP the higher that gets. Gotcha. Okay. Hope you're having a good day, Paris. It looks like my prediction was on point, too. What was your prediction? That we'll be able to get through the introduction, tutorial, and maybe the first quest in the first stream. Oh, cool. We've got about 30 minutes left till your usual stop time. Okay, so I guess I can Now you can go just to go to the Guildmaster. Gotcha, okay. Yep. And technically there's a couple other small things, but they aren't really anything crazy. Hmm. And one of them I do not want to try and guide you through. Wait, what's happening? Did I make a mistake? No. No. What you confused about? Well, it says I gotta go there on the map, but I don't see... Follow the pathway zero. Uh, okay. Dylan, the shopkeeper. You fall to the right place. <laughs> Let's see. Other chess piece. Five hundred seven gold. Jeebus, I only have seventy two. I can assure you things get much more expensive. Eleven thousand for plate leggings. Yeah. I will say plate is the best armor in the game, so it makes sense. Mm -hmm. Okay. Feeling the pain yet? Well, the guild isn't meant to be easy. Eh? Uh, 
Hello. You just behind you and progress on to your final training? Yes. The boy mastered the skills quickly, but there was always more to learn. Yeah, things are good for, for years. Me. The guild was his home, his school, and his life. But as time passed, things are going pretty well. His yeah, thoughts returned always to the world outside, the life he had lost, the family that had been torn from him. At last, only the final day of tests remained. Success would mark the end of his training. He would receive the guild seal and be free to forge his own destiny. He would become a hero. Before you graduate, there is one final test you must complete. Enter the guild woods and go to the log at the top of the hill. The test will be revealed to you there. Okay. Good luck. All right. What are you doing out here, boy? I'm just trying to do the thing. I suppose you're wondering how you pass the final test then. It's simple. You must defeat me using all you've learned in your years of training. We'll begin with your sword. Hit me, if you can. I want you to hit me as hard as you can. Hit me if you can. I can't move. You got yourself stuck on a rock. A good strike. Good strike. Very good. Now, shoot me with your bow. Uh, don't get too close. Well He's just gonna stand there. Yes. Not like you're actually a threat to him. Excellent! And finally, cast lightning at me. Uh. That's enough. Yes, quite impressive for a novice. You will find real battles rather more fatal than this. But you have passed your final test, and you're ready to receive your guild seal from the guild master. All right. Well then. Oh. Keep getting stuck on rocks. Have you tried not hitting the rocks? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? No. <laughs> well, this is the day, lad. I remember the first night you came to us. And look at you now. Maze's faith in you was well placed. Now come along. The graduation ceremony will take place in the Chamber of Fate, the oldest part of the guild. Let the apprentices approach. For many years now, you have worked hard to earn yourselves the title of hero. Today, that apprenticeship ends and you go out into the world to do great deeds. Deeds that will bring you the gratitude of thousands. Or strike fear into their hearts. These are dark times. The shadows of Albion are stirring and strange winds are blowing. Your choices 
whether they lead you down the path of good or evil, will change the face of the world. Now, take your guild seals and venture forth as heroes. Alrighty then. Mm-hmm. I have become a hero. You am hero. I am hero. It's time for you to leave us then. But you're still very much part of the guild. On the map table, you will find details of any quests the people of Albion wish heroes to perform. And you'll need to return often to focus all your experience into new skills. Only by doing this regularly will you advance as a hero. Step into the light and I'll show you how to do this. No, don't go into the light. Okay. Let's see. Okay, how many points do I have? You have 500 general, you have 96 strength XP. Oh, okay. There's general experience. Oh, no, you have 611 general experience. But as you can tell, it's each broken up into different sections for strength, skill, and will. So basically, strength XP you, use by, you earn by using melee weapons in combat, skill from obviously using bows or from bartering, and will is from using okay. magic. I think this was what Mittens was talking about, to not spend the skill points yet. To wait till uh, I do that. That doesn't really matter. Things get exponentially expensive, so you shouldn't have any issue running it into max. There is little else for me to teach you, but I will always be around to offer you guidance. And your guild seal will allow me to communicate with you at all times. You will also notice it flashing when you have enough experience to spend. I have given you a basic pack of supplies. It'll be enough for a while. Now there's a whole world for you to explore. A hey. resurrection files, your lamp, and two health potions. Now where's the sword he's talking about? You are not going to find it for a while. Oh, okay. It is well into the story. Is it? Yes. Is this all side stuff or is this story stuff? The first one is the only one you can take. A character comes by later to pick up those three. Oh, okay. So I should take You are this? never able to do those quests. Yes, just take the wasp's quest. I can't do these ones? No. Then why do they give them to you? They don't. As you can see, you can't take them. Why are they even listed if I can't do them? Because, as I just said, a, another character, as an introduction to that character, comes by and picks those ones up. So they take the they take the quests? Sn yes, they take the snow troll attack, suppressing uprising in Menyon Camp. Okay. Oh, but I still do them, technically. No, you only do the wasp menace because that's the only one you can take. So uh, these just they just show you these and you can never do them again. You could never do them in the first place. Then why do they show them? I'm so confused. Don't worry about it. Take wasp menace. I don't like wasps. Oh, good, because you get to kill them. Okay, good. Uh, can I not open doors? Oh, there we go. You can. It's glowing blue, which means you can interact with it. Oh, okay. Well, I was hitting A and nothing was happening. I was like, what? What's going on here? And then it start, uh, suddenly started working. Weird. Oh, excuse me. Following the gold markers on your map will lead you to your quest <laughs> objective. Wasps are attacking the picnic area. Follow me. Follow okay. Follow me. It's this 
see way. your face in a mirror. Hey. It's like, look at this filthy pile of rags. He really expects people to give him gold. Well, if you want, I'll tell you something that'll really annoy you. I'm good. I got to say <laughs> Uh oh Jesus <laughs> Oh god, they're killing people Yes, yes they are That's fast. I mean, yeah, they're only wasps. Thank you so much. Wait till everyone Health potion. Oh, you made Mama mad. Oh, the queen. <laughs> They collided with the uh, compass in the center. Your bow may prove useful against the boss of Queen. Say. No, I don't want to target you. Attack the wasp queen again. Ah. Uh, also use your will powers against her. There you go. Congratulations. I beat the wasps. They only killed three people. And my sword's going yeah. through my butt. Yes. Which is impressive considering how flat it is. Hey. You received a new quest card. There is stuff on the tables, by the way. Oh, there was? Oh, okay. Yep. Gotta press A to grab them. Apple pie! Pills potion. Hey, apples. Green apple. And a beard, I want to say? Yeah. Yep. Or the half frame, I saw it. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Just stealing everyone's uh, picnics. Oh, is they're dead. They're not going to miss it. No, oh, you're fine. Okay. I just find it funny that after it, after the wasps kill everyone, you just steal their food. I mean, no one else is going to eat it. That's exactly what I was saying. And see, now you got a little area to where the wasps were. Well, shit. And if you yeah. go back to the guild. If memory serves, you'll be introduced to the character I was telling you about. What a repulsive heap of rags! Used to be an adventurer like yourself, but look at me now. Oh God! Survive and getting bullied by this brat all the time. I was an adventurer like you once, but then I took an arrow to the knee. Shame this predate this line predates Skyrim. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, Can you imagine if Skyrim got the line from this? That'd be funny, that'd be funny. as fuck. You 
must be able to get rid of him somehow. Anything will do. Use your imagination. If you can get him to leave, it'll be so funny. Well, I'll be here if you change your mind. Oh, to have a uh, again. The, uh... Try right anything. on the D-pad. Why do you say that? Because there's the fart expression, which is, you basically want to disgust the guy, the bully. Keep doing it. Or, oh, I only needed it once. Ah, okay. you're as bad as that stinking beggar. Oh, I'm out of here. <laughs> There's a fart button in this game? Yes. <laughs> funny shit people... I've ever seen. <laughs> funny and, it's funny you say that because in Fable 2 and 3, you have the ability to hold an expression. And if you fail the expression, you shit yourself. <laughs> That's great. Yeah. And you get 20 good points for doing that, so. Yeah. Uh, head back to the guild. That's what I'm planning on doing. You're going the wrong way. No, it's telling me to go that way. That is Bower Stone. But it's telling me to go that way. Because if you're listening, the guild, the, gu the guild master said to meet Maze and Bower Stone. That's where, that's where that is. Okay, so where am I going? This way? That way. Towards the guild. The big brown box. So why am I not going the way the game's telling me to go? Because I said this is how you meet that character I was telling you about. Oh, do you not meet them otherwise? No. If you don't do this, you don't meet them until much later in the game. Assuming my memory serves. I haven't played the game in a while. Are you going to have to fire the game up? Oh, yep, there she is. Looks promising. Oh, hello. You must be the kid Maze is always talking about. Can't imagine what he sees in you. Still. I suppose Maze knows best. But where are my manners? I'm Briar Rose. No doubt you've heard of me. No time for autographs, I'm afraid. I have to get to Knothole Glade for an important mission. Speaking of which, if you came for a quest card, all the best ones have gone already. I'm sure the guild can find you something to do, though. I hear the kitchens need cleaning. Okay, then. Yep. There's also leveling up if you want to do that. No, I've got to get the sword. Zero? What? The, the island to the left is where you get the sword. You will not see that for several streams. What can I do you for? I gotta get the sword. So the sword has set requirements. I still don't know what Mittens was going on about. I mean, if you want to play the game without leveling up, you'll do something I've never done before, then. Wait, do I just, like, stay at level one? Yes. You use experience to level up. You're new here, aren't you? Got that we have right. some rules around here that you need to know about. Bower Stone is a peaceful town. Ah, I'd have to confiscate your weapon. There are shops, inns, lots of different people, games, <laughs> all kinds of things. Why not pay the tavern a visit first? It's the building in uh, front of you. Somebody's Check drunk the road from here. there. Oh, yep. And keep an eye open for Lady Grey. Treat her with respect. She is the mayor, after all. Have a look around and enjoy your stay in Bowerstone. Hmm.
over here. What do you think, young man? Been enjoying all the attention, have you? Yes. I heard about your encounter with the Wasp Queen. Most of Bowerstone is talking about it. But, um, <laughs> you shouldn't let that kind of thing go to your head. Uh, anyway, hey. I'll check why I you here. You see, there are dark forces gathering that put your giant insect to shame. Oh, Tell you don't me, say. How much do you remember of the night I took you to the guild? Of the raid on Oakvale? Not much, I wager. A most terrible night. I thought those bandits had killed your whole family. And that you were going to be next. But it seems there may have been another survivor. Your sister. I'm afraid it's only a rumor. Uh. And there's no way to be certain yet. But I thought you should know. And for pity's sake, boy. Make sure you replace that basic equipment while you're here. Check the guild for more quests. I thought I was getting new equipment. Yes. How's it going? Chicken chasing. Oh god, the game is chugging. Yeah, a little bit. Is there not a local blacksmith? Or oh, there he is. There is right there. You've come to the right place. Okay. Iron cleaver, eh? I want to say this guy goes up to obsidian weapons for my research. Yeah, I see obsidian there, but that's way too expensive. Actually, the iron greatsword's stronger than the steel longsword. Yeah, you can't use the iron greatsword, though. Oh, f oh level three. Okay. <laughs> Yes, you actually have to level up to use weapons. Well, shit. My cousin says orchard miles long. Guess I'll go back to the guild then. But I'm not going nowhere near there. Yeah, there is a blacksmith and an armorer in this city. Or a town or whatever. I'm not going to equip it back? Dude? Not while you're in Bowerstone, no. He confiscates equipment while you're in Bowerstone. Yeah, but I'm leaving. That's not leaving. Oh. That's another section of Bowerstone. Oh. He's B. Which way is the way out of here? Keep going forward. Take a right. Keep heading forward. Take a left. Take a right. Keep heading forward. Through the bagel doors. Or through the coolest gate to teleport directly to the guild. Don't go breaking any laws. I need to get my stuff back though. No, you don't. You get them when you leave. Oh, okay.
Okay. Back to the guild I am. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. You know what? I'll level up my stats then. Or mm, maybe I'll wait. Level up. But the thing. It's not going to matter. Okay, fine. It needs like level 8 across physique, health, and toughness. That's it. Level 8? Yes. You are not going to be hitting that anytime soon. And you're going to die a lot if you don't level up. I'd say take level one and all three of those and something in skill. Skill? RT. Oh. Right trigger. There you go. There's your skill. Uh, let's go speed. Go, and that's all you can level up. Okay. Now you can check what quests are available. Yeah. Okay. Now you can either protect or attack. Hmm. One has you protecting from bandits, one has you joining the bandits to attack against the guards. Okay. High risk, high reward, or more safety for less reward. You will not get punished for whichever one you end up doing. Oh, okay. Take quest and boast? What does that mean? It, boasting is basically you adding self-inflicted challenges on top of the quest that give you better rewards. So for your first playthrough, I think you're fine just doing take quest. Okay. Also, how much longer you want to go since we're two, two before 11? This will probably be it. Okay. In that case, I'm going to run to the bathroom. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Just sitting up a bit. So you're going to be doing some work down at Orchard Farm, are you? I knew that was your two calling. Tell you what, I'm going to pick up the other side of this little quest and teach you how to choose better friends. I hope you've been practicing. You'll need all the experience you can get to beat me. See you later, farm boy. Simple. 
Hi, I'm back. Welcome back. I'm fighting wasps. I can see that. Left over there. There you are. You ready for a bit of violence? The farm's just behind this gate. Mob's here. He's gonna blow it in a moment. We're after some crates the farmer's got stored in his barn. Don't know what's in them, and I don't much care. We're just paid to do a job, so don't go asking questions. Just lead us to those crates, and we'll grab them. All right, mobs. Let's do it. Come on, let's go. Cover me while I get the crate. For honor! <laughs> behind you. I'll get the crate. I've got your back. Okay, there is one crate. Oh, I've got to get it? No. The guys here with pick up the crate. Oh, okay. You just have to defend them. Right is mine. And now they're moving the last crate. Oh, yeah, I see it's moving. Mm -hmm. Oh. So, and there you go. You've learned some new moves, have you? And now a fight you with Whisper. The only one. I hope you've learned how to flourish, because that's the only way you're going to get close to me. Go on, try to hit me with a flourish. Or a special flourish move when that appears. Well, that's when your sword glows. So you can do it. I'm still going to beat you, though. Oh, I'm stuck on the wheel. Damn, you beat me again. I suppose this quest is yours then. But you can't stay lucky forever, farm boy. 
We're bound to meet again, and I'll be ready. And she's gone. Everybody always teleports away. Let's go. You've got the boxes. Mm -hmm. There's nothing else. I mean, that's what the gold seal does. It teleports you. Congratulations. <laughs> wow. I got a shield. You know what yep. No, you didn't get a shield. That's a brooch. Oh, I thought it was a shield. Nope. Whisper the brooch. But yeah, you see that thing in the bottom left yeah. on the downward, down D-pad? Yes. That's your guild seal. You basically hold that down and you can fast travel. Oh, really? What? What's mm. at the bottom? How do Gotta I hold, hold it. it down? Oh. The D-pad, okay. Yep. All right. And you can teleport anywhere with a cool escape. Nice. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, I think it's time for me to stop. <laughs> I'm getting tired. Okay. Got a nice tidy thousand gold from that too. Hell yeah. Uh, okay, so... It's gonna save. Okay, there we go. Oh, <laughs> auto save already. Okay. All right. Well, and we'll have to uh, come back to this next week. Mm -hmm. Do some more stuff. Just a game so far. <clears throat> All right. What was that? I said interesting game so far. Mm -hmm. All right. So let me find something to read. I'm yeah. For a game from 2004, it's not bad. Yeah, yeah, no, totally. Jeez, Nightman. <laughs> Net having trouble, I guess? Oh, he's. Blondie's oh, if you want to do him. He's finishing uh, Final Fantasy VIII tonight. Ooh. A game he has not really How enjoyed that much, but. <laughs> <laughs> It is what it is. Uh, let me just go. Since he's finishing up, we should, we should probably read Nightman. That'd probably be a good idea. I couldn't tell by the fact he went live four separate times. Yeah. Uh, uh, that's what I was just saying. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, one fantasy to another. And this one might be final, even though it's the eighth time. Uh, we're going to go ahead and raid Nightman. Um,. You guys know the drill, but in case you don't, that's okay, because I'll tell you anyways. Uh, here is the raid message if you're subbed. Uh, if you're not, you can use this one instead. Uh, you can... Um, if you guys want to join the Discord server uh, and uh, hang out or join us for Toka Tuesday, we're currently watching uh, Garo. We're, we're going to be doing episode 6. Wait, no, no. Sorry, episode five and six um, tomorrow night. So if you want to join us for that, uh, you can. Or just hang out with some cool peeps. Uh, you can find my social medias here, my YouTube channels here, and the newest videos I made here. Again, raid message if you're subbed. If you're not, you can use this one instead. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow night for Lords of Exile. Hopefully finishing that game. Uh, and when I finish that, I'm going to... Uh, do our Z on Tuesdays, or our Z? Sorry, the uh, the CDI Zelda inspired game, because I was having a lot of fun with that game. Mm. Uh, and then Wednesday, I don't know what we're doing. I think we're doing Sonic Racing Transformed on the Wii U. We're still doing the Wii U stuff before the shop shuts down. But anyways, guys, take care. Come here and rush. Use a brush. Don't do drugs. Stay in school. Eat your teeth. I'll see you next time. I cheat. Go say a nightmare for me and have a good night. Bye bye. Bye. Oh, he's in the fight with Ultimecia. Nice. <laughs>